Okay, last question. <clears throat> Is it okay if I didn't type scan f along with bin f? Hmm, I, I I don't know what you mean by this. Is it because of uh, what have I have discussed so far? Yeah, because previous in previous feedback, I always uh, highlight or emphasize on you know uh, to do some application, you must uh, couple between uh, you must couple the print f. I'm sorry, you must couple scan f between uh, between you must couple your scan f with print f. Uh, the if that is the that is uh, the question is the question is for that issue and uh, the if that is the issue that you want to highlight then the answer is uh, not necessary okay again like I said uh, in general when when I said uh, you must in general scan F must uh, couple with print F because again uh, if you don't have print F then you don't give any instruct, instruction to the user because the user again only see this one they don't see the code so that's why uh, when the client or the user want to use your software or your program they always see here so that's why uh, because this is uh, okay if you when the, the, the function or the your program is execute scan f without print f then how come the user know uh, what to do because let's say I just put there scan F okay I put that scan F uh, let's say integers um, integer X okay I put as integer X and then I don't have print F here okay print F here again I just put you know scan F Then I want to have my my D there, and then this is my end uh, of my X. So if I execute this code, okay, okay. So actually, you, the user only see this one. The user does does not see this one, or the client only see this one. The client does not see this one. So actually, what the what are the client or your user want to do? Because uh, actually what you want the user to do is to key in some number because that number you need to be you need that number to be stored in your variable called x. But now because you don't give some instruction, so that's why the user don't know what to do. So which is why uh, I said in our discussion, previous discussion, in general, because we want to have some program which is, uh, you know, uh, uh, interactive and uh, user friendly so that's why we need to have an instruction where if you want to give some instruction then you need to use a printf because only the printf can send your instruction from this program to the display here over here or the, the output there okay that's why you need to use the output function called printf because you want to send some interaction in instruction in text or in sentence to be displayed at this uh, your 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 screen monitors there. So that's why you put that. Please insert x value. Okay. So now when you run the program, sorry forget to put the same commas there okay please insert x value then of course uh, if you don't put the this one because I don't put the the new lines there backslash n that's why the cursor is over here okay now I put the backslash n now the cursor at the below then I just put any numbers because I know the as a client, I know that the, this program asked me to insert some numbers there. Some numbers where that numbers I want to store it my into that X variable. Then I set 45. Okay, so hopefully then you don't confuse with that. Okay, in the second issue in aromatic expression slide, can you explain more about casting and the rule of letting the expression?
okay this one um i need to check on which because again i i said when you ask the question please also uh, give me the slide number because this slide is originally from uh, you know from our coordinator which is dr tan so i also not familiar with the slide so when you ask the question i need to find the slide this one is related to which slide okay uh, i think those those who ask this question might uh, you know you can whatsapp me privately then uh, so we can discuss more detail because i i also don't know uh, because i need to find uh, which slide i refer at okay um 